Alrighty guys, what is going on? My name is Toby and welcome back to more SVR 2011. We have to face, well, two out of those three men back there. We've got a one-on-three match as punishment for stealing Triple H's belt. His father-in-law is punishing us, basically saving him. So here we go. We got three men we got to try to beat tonight. Now, I don't know if we're supposed to win or not, but we're going to try our damnedest to see if we can pull out this W to try to get that big, beefy, juicy win as out comes Kofi. Yeah, we don't care. Skip all the entrances. Jericho has got to try to overcome everybody. Wait, why is Jericho out? Wait. Oh, it's like, um... Okay, that's not the kind of match I thought it was going to be. I thought it was one on three. I didn't think it was going to be this kind of match. So essentially, to win, we have to pin Jericho, we have to pin Mark Henry, and then we have to pin Batista. Come on, Kofi. Get back in the ring, dude. I can't beat you if you don't come back in running Bulldog. So basically, we don't need to uh, stall at all because we got three different matches. Nice drop kick. Is that enough to put him away? Jericho trying to finish things off early. One. No, he's able to power out at one. Come on, Jericho. Now, if you think about it, I wonder who's second. I, I hope it's Mark Henry because I hope Batista, as a former world champion, would be number three. I mean, if I'm just if I'm booking it, I'm having Batista outlast. If Mark Henry's last, I don't I don't I'm not a big fan of that. As we're just stomping away on Kofi Kingston, the guy that started this whole storyline when he won his United States title. Although we have yet to drop that title, but they have never shown him wearing it because Jericho has been so consumed with that uh, WWE championship of Triple H's. Look at this. This would be the easiest of the matches, I think. Like, if they, they actually had these matches, obviously, Kofi, you know, could give him a run for his money a little bit. But if you're going to have uh, three matches in a row, this would probably be the quickest one. As Jericho going in the corner. Is he going for a suplex? Jericho going for a top rope suplex. Come on, Jericho. From the top rope. Superplex from the top. As Jericho taking time to gloat. Now, does the other guy come out right away? Can we, like, store a signature or finisher? Can I make him tap and then instantly hit the next guy to come out with a code breaker? Because I know in some of the later WWE games, you could if you had matches like that. As Kofi isn't getting any moves in whatsoever. And I don't plan on letting him get any moves in either. Just going to keep dropping him. Look at Kofi's back. It's red. All right, Kofi. I got to do one more move, and then I'm going to hit you with the... Uh, Oh, the atomic drop. Uh-oh, here we go. Make Kofi Kingston tap out. No, no, no. Get him more in the center of the ring. Come on. Tap out, Kofi, so we can keep that finisher. Is Kofi going to tap out? Every other match we've done so far. Yes, he taps out. So Kofi Kingston taps out. Here comes Mark Henry. Oh, Mark Henry. No, don't don't burn the finisher. Come on, Mark. God damn it. No. <laughs> We're going to lose the finisher. No, come on, Mark. Come on, Mark. Get up. Get up. Oh, we lost the finisher. Step up Enziguri to Mark Henry. Is that enough to put Mark away? That actually is kind of sweet though that he was trying to he was timing that just right and it backfired completely. And Batista is last. So if we lose to Batista, I wouldn't be that upset. It's not going to be the worst thing in the world. As Mark Henry not going down off his feet. Jericho trying so hard. Chris Jericho is a decent and honorable man. Three stars. I keep thinking of the show review. If you ever saw the show review on Comedy Central. Big fan of it. Look at Jericho. Come on, steal one. One. Two. And no, Mark Henry able to kick out again. Jericho, I wouldn't take time to gloat. This is Mark Henry. This is the world's strongest man. Off of the ropes. Oh, Mark Henry reverses it, though. A Lion Tamer fan. I'm a Lion Tamer fan, too, man. A drop kick. Still not going down. Step up, Enziguri. Mark Henry finally off his feet. Jericho trying to make Mark Henry tap out. Is Mark Henry going to tap out? This is going to be two men back-to-back. -back. Is this what we're going to do to Triple H at the Elimination Chamber pay-per-view? Are we going to make Triple H tap out and regain our WWE Championship? Does Mark have any option but to tap out? 
I'm pretty sure Mark is going to tap out. Jericho. Oh, no. He's able to break out of it. Again, he stuffs me. Again, he stuffs me. But finally, it took like four attempts. Codebreaker out of nowhere. And that's going to be it for Mark Henry. One, two, three. So the last match, it's Batista. In comes Batista. And Batista is not messing around. Batista coming in hot and heavy as Mark Henry and Kofi Kingston have been eliminated. Atomic drop. Batista, I don't think Batista was expecting this. Goes for the running forearm. Did not get all of it. I think he was trying to send him over the top rope. Jericho just chopping away at him. Batista finally shuts it down. Do we almost have a signature already? Yeah, we do. Oh, Batista shuts it down off the reversal. Oh, we got to be careful. This is uh, his, his evolution brethren. Triple H is out here for a reason. Not Triple H. Batista. Batista was in on it. Evolution. Triple H is given favors, man, from his uh, dad. His father-in-law, I should say. Going for the pin. One, two, and no. We probably should lose, but I don't know if we're supposed to lose, or else I would totally lose. I wish I kind of knew if this was a branching storyline or not, because if it was, he's got the walls of Jericho just wrenched in. He better not tap out, because Mark Henry... <coughs> Mark Henry... <coughs> Mark Henry did not tap out that fast. So if Batista taps out, don't do it. And no, Batista's able to power out. But he walks right into a code breaker. So when you thought Jericho had no shot, Jericho is so determined to get his title back. One, two, three, and he has done it. He has overcame everybody tonight. Holy crap. Chris Jericho is not messing around. Jericho is a person, but you can't take anything away from him tonight. Three huge wins in one night, Michael. That's given him some huge momentum heading into Elimination Chamber. Jericho can have the thrill of victory tonight. But it won't compare with the agony of defeat coming for him at Elimination Chamber. I notice he's not even making eye contact with you, Triple H. Will Elimination Chamber be Chris Jericho's last stand? So that did not go the way that Triple H wanted it to. Triple H basically set that up with his father-in-law as some punishment, some beat-down gimmicks. And it didn't go down as we are in St. Louis, Missouri. If you think about it, Chris Jericho is losing a bunch. And then ultimately, um, after losing a bunch to him, he would go on a huge winning streak, winning the U.S. title among many other matches, and finally getting that opportunity. All right, let's go use some of these stamina points. As we can see Ryder, we can see Orton. We can see everybody that's going on. Let's go use some of these stamina points down there. What's up, Big Show? How you doing, Show? run right down here use some of these i think we have enough to level up one i'm not sure which one we have enough to level up but let's see well we do have 2600 points okay so we want grapple damage yeah i'm gonna put that one at grapple damage all right there we go confirm make sure we can do as much damage as possible all right let's run right out all right i'm ready now, uh, where's the title? Do we have it on us, or is it hidden somewhere? Because I'm assuming we take it out to the ring. Let's go see if his evolution brethren has anything to say. Okay, never mind. We don't want to touch him. All right, so we have the Elimination Chamber. Kid, Crime Time, Mark Henry MVP, Michelle Molina, SmackDown Elimination Chamber, Jericho versus Big Show versus Triple H versus Swagger versus Orton versus Cena. So why is there three elimination chambers? Why doesn't it just say raw elimination chamber? And why is it not just me versus him? I mean, I guess it does save the match. I was expecting a one-on-one -on -one match, to be honest with you. Upcoming match is Chris Jericho versus Swagger versus Randy Orton versus Big Show versus Triple H for the elimination chamber championship. For the elimination chamber championship. For the WWE elimination chamber match for the WWE Raw championship. Wow. That's a that's a, a mouthful. Down. 
Jericho! Jericho! One! Two! Oh, God. Wait, what? No way! We gotta redo the match. Come on!